Taxpayers in Bay County might see an uptick in their property taxes in 2024. County commissioners took the next steps to increase millage rates next year. They say the county is running low on cash reserves. News Channel 7's Victoria Scott covered it and joins us in the studio. Victoria, they say a big problem has been state tax holidays. Hey guys, that's right. State tax breaks are aimed at saving you some cash on certain items. But Bay County commissioners say that's one reason why they may have to raise taxes on locals. County leaders agreed to increase the millage rate by 1.25 mills. It would be the first rate increase since 2014. But nothing is set in stone yet. The current general fund millage rate for the county is around 4.44 mills. The proposed rate would bring it to nearly 5.7 mills. Officials say that increase amounts to $20 million yearly if it's approved. The county manager says a number of factors are causing the increase. Some examples include spikes in property insurance rates, increasing base pay to $15 per hour, and an uptick in costs for the Department of Juvenile Justice in Bay County. We're told that expense alone increased by roughly $800,000 this year, but that's only part of it. You know, one of the big drivers this year uh, is the uh, sales tax holidays. And so um, we are looking at almost $4.5 million in existing revenue being erased uh, as a result of those sales tax holidays being implemented. And uh, what's significant about our general fund is 50% of our general fund pays for public safety operations. So you're talking about law enforcement, jail operations, and our uh, emergency medical service system. County leaders say they'll try to find ways to lower the rate between now and September. A vote on the final rate then. Stephen. Victoria, where can residents go if they have questions? I'm sure they have lots of them. They're encouraged to contact the Bay County Property Appraiser's Office if they have any questions about it. Guys. All right. Thank you, Victoria.